The Promise in Glen Rose is a full-length musical presentation of the life of Christ, and it is actually the premier musical presentation of the life of Christ that happens outdoors, and it's been happening here in Glen Rose for 32 years in this magnificent facility on top of a hill that overlooks the beautiful town of Glen Rose. I actually came to Glen Rose in 2017, and my wife and I, looking for a place that we could worship and fellowship together, and uh, I had visited the church uh, before, and then driving by, I noticed on the marquee there was a new name down there at the bottom, Pastor Owen McKnight, and I thought, hmm, I wonder who that is. So I just stopped my car and moseyed inside, knocked on his door and introduced myself. And, and uh, reintroduced me to the promise and, and the ministry that it is and the people that are involved and engaged in it. And uh, so uh, for about a year, uh, Chuck and I kind of dreamed together about how our church might connect with and partner with Promise as the Promise shares the truth of the gospel in a, in a very real and tangible way. For us, I think we're uniquely positioned because this is an opportunity that churches can say, hey, maybe I've got friends or family members or connections that uh, I'm just not able to get them to come inside the doors of a church for whatever reason. But the promise is a way that in a very non-confrontational kind of way, you can invite friends and family to come and see a beautiful professional production uh, that presents the story uh, in a way that people can perceive it without uh, maybe they don't have any exposure to the Bible at all. Maybe they've never read the Bible or whatever, but a lot of people have said it's just like the stories of the Bible are coming to life. We have the same mission, to make disciples of Jesus Christ for the transformation of the world. But as many pastors and many churches have said, we're having to uh, follow the same mission, but perhaps through a different mode. And so that's the wonderful opportunity that we've had here partnering with this wonderful cast and crew and team. And what that means is that Owen has been a part of the uh, ministry team on the platform and in the prayer tent that we have. Uh, he's helped me kind of guideline through some of the issues that we've had with uh, protocol for COVID this year. But he's been available to minister to people, to greet people, to host the promise itself. I've hosted a few times uh, our pre-show and introduced uh, musicians and special guests. But most of all, the, the greatest opportunity that I've had here at The Promise is at the end of every presentation, uh, we have the opportunity to invite people into relationship with Jesus Christ. They have now uh, heard the gospel, uh, mostly based on the gospel of Matthew, a uh, wonderful, vibrant story in dance and, and in theater and in song but we don't want them to leave without the opportunity to receive Christ. This is my beloved son. We invite any and all churches who might be thinking about doing ministry in a different way, might think about coming out and being ushers and greeters, might think about coming and bringing their classic adults group or their youth group for youth night. Certainly Chuck and The Promise would welcome that phone call uh, if you might be interested in connection. I would as well. I'd be happy to hear from you uh, at First Methodist Church if you're thinking about possibly partnering with us uh, and other churches as we support this wonderful ministry going into 2021.